Hello, everyone. Welcome to class. My name is Tammy, and our focus is on core, strengthening our core and booty. So important for posture, so important for balance, so important for strengthening our back. So lots of focus on thinking about activating those muscles that we will use throughout the movements, the postures, and beginning. Top of the mat, mat for our warm up. So we stand tall, draw your feet in towards the ground, and lift up. Here, I want you to engage your quadriceps, thinking about drawing your kneecaps up towards your hips, tailbone down, tuck in your chin, thumbs towards the front, and inhale, sweep the arms up overhead, namaskar A, exhale, dive forward, bend through the knees, hinge through the hips, let the head go. Inhale, come up to halfway, left flat back. Exhale, release, fold, head hangs. Inhale, come up to halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, release, fold, let the head hang. Dangling here, hold on to opposite elbows, let the head sway side to side, upper body swaying side to side. Come to center, let the arms hang. Inhale, come up to halfway lift. Exhale, release, fold, take the hands down to the ground, step back into plank, right? Left foot, hold plank. We hold plank. This is what I really want you to thinking, thinking about now, engaging those core muscles. So it is your rundas, your energy locks, drawing the navel to the spine lifting up to the pelvic floor muscles. We do use them at different times here, lifting up through the top of your palate. Jutting the body forward, take the knees down to the ground, continue to hold. Nice ski slope. We lower our body in towards the ground, continue to engage your bandhas, draw the elbows in towards the side of the body and lower. Uncurl the toes. Engage your, your glute muscles, squeeze, and lift up to a small up dog. Exhale, release, doing that again, pressing down through the tops of your feet. Inhale, lift, exhale, release. One more time, squeeze your glutes. Inhale, lift, exhale to down your facing dog. Take those toes down to the ground and slowly push to down your face and dog. Alternate knee bends. Breathing. Draw the heels down to the ground and hold stillness. Bend through the knees, everyone. Look to the hands, walk the feet forward. Ankles, knees, hips in line with each other, head hangs. Inhale, come up to halfway. Lift, exhale, release, fold. Inhale, sweep your arms up, overhead. Exhale, hands to the heart center. We just got right into it. So this time, focus a little bit more. We stand tall. Draw the tailbone down, engage your bandhas. Draw the navel in, draw everything into the center midline of the body. Namaskar A again, our warm up sun salutation. Inhale, draw your arms up overhead. Exhale, dive forward, flat back, bend through the knees enough to help. Inhale, come up to halfway lift. Exhale, take your hands down to the ground, step back to plank. We hold plank here. Holding plank, pushing the mat away from yourself. You may lightly grip the mat here with your finger pads, or it might be, need a little bit stronger. Jutting the body forward, knees down to the ground. We lower into the ground. Uncurl the toes. Engage your glute muscles. Inhale, lift, elbows by the side of the body. 
exhale, downward facing dog. Nice upside down. You may alternate knee bends or hold stillness. And the knees enough too to help. Or legs may be straight. Keep breathing. Keep your core engaged. Lengthening out through your hamstrings. Exhale, bend through the knees, look to the hands, walk the feet to the top of your mat. Inhale, happy lift, lava. Exhale, release, fold, your head hangs. Inhale, sweep your arms up, overhead. Exhale, hands to the heart center. Nicely done. When we do that lift, coming up, really engaging through our core, through our foundation, you're feeling yourself rooted into the ground to hold. One more time through. Inhale, sweep your arms up overhead. Exhale, dive forward, keep focusing. Inhale. Keep focusing on your foundation. Halfway lift, exhale to plank. Keep focusing on using your core muscles, one does. Jutting the body forward, lower yourself into the ground. Inhale to up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, hold. Exhale, hold. Inhale, hold. Exhale, hold. I put some cream on my hand, hands before, and I'm sliding a little bit. With the exhale breath, bend through the knees, lift to the hands, and we walk forward. This time, big toes touch. Okay, inhale, come up to halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, release, fold, head hangs. Inhale all the way up, draw your arms up overhead, engage your glutes, exhale, hands down to your heart. Continue to stand tall, draw the tailbone down towards the ground. With an inhale breath, come into a squat. Exhale, hold. Inhale, hold. Exhale, hold, releasing the shoulders away from the ears. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, coming all the way up. Exhale, dive forward. Inhale, come up to halfway lift. Namaskara, B now. Sun citation B. Happy lift, flat back. Exhale to plank. Doing this again. Hold, and then jut the body forward. You can come down to the knees or lower yourself into the ground. Inhale to up dog, squeeze your glutes, keep it bone down. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale to three-legged dog. Take the right leg up towards the sky. Exhale, step your foot between your hands. Lunge, coming up nice and strong. Your balance, use your core, engage your legs. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, three legged dog, left leg lifts. Engage your core. Exhale, step between your hands. Inhale, come up to high lunge. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, hold. Exhale, hold. Lift up through your pelvic floor muscles. The exhale breath. We bend through the knees. Lift the hands, walk the feet forward, big toes touch. Inhale, halfway lift. Flat back. Exhale, release, hold. Inhale to squat. Exhale all the way up. And arms sweep around the other way. Good. Okay. We hold nice and tall. 
draw the navel in towards the spine, lifting up through the pelvic floor muscles. Inhale, breath into crescent moon. We draw our arms up overhead, intertwine your fingers. Exhale, come up and over to the left side. Inhale, hold. Exhale, hold. Inhale, breath coming up all the way. And exhale, dive forward. Inhale, halfway lift, flat up. Exhale, release, fold, head hangs. Press the moon on the other side and inhale, sweep your arms up overhead or decline your fingers again. Wrap your thumbs around opposite way and exhale up over to the right side, side bend. Inhale, hold, arms are close by the ears. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, coming up all the way, and exhale, dive forward. Bend to the knees. Inhale, happy lift, flat back. Exhale, hold, release. Inhale, all the way up. Bring your arms up overhead, and then exhale, hands to the heart center. Okay, very good. Back into a squat. Place your hands onto the hips, sitting back into a squat. Feel your foundation. Take your hands to your heart center now. Continue to hold, checking to see if your knees are passing your toes. Engage your glute muscles, muscles around your pelvis, pulling the navel in. So always through your foundation first, you set yourself up and then move into all those other stabilizing muscles that we need for a pose. Core all the time. <laughs> holding, holding with an inhale breath, make your way back up. Exhale, hold. Hands onto your hips, bend through the knees, step or jump out, ankles, knees, hips in line with each other. Bend through the knees and step straight back to a high lunge. The distance between your legs is your one leg distance. Hands onto the hips, hands out to shoulder height, or hands above the head, relax through the shoulders. Come down to the ground with the knee, letting it come down about an inch or two, and then up. Come down towards the ground, and then up with the breath. Inhale, breath is so important when we're working here. Inhale, breath supporting your spine, exhale breath, lift. Inhale breath, down, support the spine, exhale up. Inhale breath, down, exhale breath up. Continue on. Squeeze your glutes, flip the lift. One more. And hold. Take your arms into in line with your shoulders. And then turn on the ball of the foot and heel comes down into warrior two. Left knee straight ahead. Open up through the pelvis. Look over the middle finger. Holding. Come a little lower. Sweep your right arm overhead and take your hands down to the ground. Come back onto the ball of your right foot. We hold. 
Hold this low lunge, come down to the knee. Continue to hold. Sit back into the heel and take your left toes up towards the sky. Stretching into our hamstrings. Add a fold forward. Slowly release, kicking the foot back towards the ground here. Now scooch this back leg back a little bit further and pelvic tilt down towards the ground. The right hip here pressing down. So they coming out of the low lunge. So you may need to scooch a little bit forward and then coming back, lifting through the knee back to a high lunge. Arms may come up overhead. Inhale, hold. Exhale to downward facing dog. Bend through the knees, look to the hands, walk your feet forward. Top of the mat, ankles, knees, hips in line with each other. Inhale, halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, release, fold, head hangs. Inhale, arms up overhead. Exhale, hands to the heart center. Let's do that all on the other side. Bend through the knees. Step your left foot straight back. Nice big lunge, just like before. Hands onto your hips or shoulders, or overhead. Making your way down towards the ground with the knee, we inhale. Exhale, lift, right knee straight ahead. Inhale down, support your spine, exhale up. Feel your foundation. Give your spine support with the inhale. Hear your breath. Relax your shoulders. One more. Squeeze your glutes right at the top. And slowly release. Take your arms down, shoulders. Okay, into warrior three. So coming on to the heel here on the bottom of the foot here. Warrior two, I'm sorry, warrior two. Lunging straight ahead. Continue to relax your shoulders, upper body over top of the pelvis, opening up. Okay, let's windmill. Windmill our left arm down and hands down towards the back, foot between your hands. Come back into the ball of the foot. Here we have our low lunge. And take the knee, left knee down towards the ground. Sit back into the heel. Right toes now drawing up towards the sky. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, hold. Sitting your hips right back. You may want to come over to the side, but you want to sit the hips back. Straight back. So we come out, kicking the foot down, scooching the back knee. Further away, pelvic tilt. 
Sit that hip down. Pelvis down into the ground. Draw the navel in. Coming out, scooch the knee forward. Back into a high lunge on your own time. And arms back into downward facing dog. Bend the knees, look to the hands, and walk the feet forward, top of the mat. Inhale, halfway lift, flat back. Feel your foundation, engage your bundles, exhale, release, hold. Inhale, sweep your arms up overhead. Exhale, hands to the heart center. Hands back onto your hips. Big toes come together, back into our squat with a twist. Sitting down into a squat, checking the knees, they are lined up. We add a twist, we twist over to the left side first, relaxing our shoulders, twisting over to the left. Place your right elbow onto the outside of the knee. Your right knee will wanna jut forward, so pull it back, keeping the knees in line with each other. Nice twist here into our core. Pulling everything in. You may take one of your arms away. So we come back to the center of the twist. Hands come down to the ground and let the head hang. Draw your bottom up towards the sky. Inhale, come up to halfway lift. Through your foundation, feel and then come up. Exhale, release, fold. Inhale, arms up overhead. Exhale, sit down into the squat again. Inhale, hold. Exhale, twist over to the right side. Place your elbow onto the outside of the right knee. Check your knees. They're in line. Left knee will want to jut ahead. May you release your arm. Pulling in our navel towards our spine. Is anyone looking at their thumb? <laughs> Slowly coming out of the twist. Turn towards the center. Hands down and head hangs. Whew. Inhale, come up to halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, release, full. Inhale, all the way up. Arms overhead, exhale, hands to the heart center. Love it. Take your hands back onto the hips, bend through the knees, step or jump out. Ankles, knees, hips in line with each other, bend through the knees, step the right foot back. Okay, take the heel down towards the ground. All of the toes facing forward, turning on your heel, left heel and toes facing forward. Open up the legs enough so we can get a little bit closer down towards the ground. Inhale, sweep your arms up overhead. Exhale, full forward, bend through the knees, folding forward. You may hold on to your big toes with your peace fingers. Inhale, lengthen through your spine. Exhale, fold, take your elbows out to the sides. The goal is to have the crown of the head on the ground. Bending through the knees helps to get a little closer to the ground and helps keep the back flat. Opening up your feet wider too does help to get a little bit closer to the ground. Inhale, breath, coming out. So let's step the hands forward. 
add a twist here for our core. Place your, uh, that's gonna be the opposite, left hand onto your left hip. I think it's your right then. <laughs> okay, add the twist. Inhale, lengthen through the spine and twisting over to the side that you place your hand. You may release your hand from your hip. You may turn, rotate a little bit more. So you're looking at your thumb, your drishti. Slowly coming out of the twist. Okay, I hope that was your right side. <laughs> Take your other hand onto your hip. Inhale, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, twisting over to the same side. Take your hand away, add a bigger twist here. Look at your thumb. So we come out with the exhale, hold. Inhale, lengthen through the spine. Exhale, make your way up to halfway. Place your hands onto the hips. Use your foundation, so feel it. Inhale, draw your core in nice and strong. Come up, small back bend. Exhale, release, bend through the knees and step into the top of the mat. Lovely. Making our way down towards the ground, you could do half of an M square A vinyasa flow with me. That is your choice. Coming down to the ground however you like, on your own time. Feel your foundational, engage your bendas. Engaging the backs of your legs. Glutes. When you're a downward facing dog, bend through the knees, walk, step forward, jump your feet forward to seated. Take your legs straight out. Reverse tabletop. Rear plank, as my son says in gymnastics. Reverse tabletop, taking your hands about three inches away so your fingers are pointing towards your bottom. You may have your legs straight or knees bent. We lift our bottom off the ground and lift. Exhale, breath, leading us out. And hold. Bending through both of the knees now. Holding behind your knees into the knee pits. Sit back, heels down towards the ground. Lift your chest up towards the sky. Engage your bandhas. Those energy locks, hold. Try to take the right foot, left foot off the ground. Continue to hold. Look at your toes. Release your right hand, release the left hand. Continue to hold our boat. Continue to be strong through your broke boat. You are strong. Smile. Relax the shoulders. Ah, slowly releasing, taking one foot and then the foot down towards the ground. Crossing your right leg over top of the left leg. Take your hands down towards the ground and lift your bottom off the ground. Release. Do that again. Lift your bottom off the ground. Release. Take it up the sauna one more time. We release. Take the legs onto the side and come to all fours. Hold here for all fours. 
bending, taking your right leg up and hold at a 90 degree angle. We hold your foot is as if it's standing on the ceiling. Continue to hold. 90 degree angle at the knee. Gripping your mat. So you're not putting too much pressure onto the wrists. Slowly release. And then to the other side. And to the other side, we lift, engage. Your bandhas always engage. Lift, we hold. Foot again parallel to the ceiling if you're standing. So we release, sit back into child's pose. Release, come onto the side of your body. Having your elbow underneath of the shoulder. Knees bent in front. See if you can have your heels in line with your bottom. Now you see me, I am slouching down towards the ground. I would like you to lift up through the waist, long through both sides of our waist, relax the shoulders. We lift our side off of the ground and arm comes overhead and back down. Side plank, we lift up and down. Breath, inhale, lift. Exhale down. Inhale, lift. Exhale down. Hold. Coming down towards the ground. Head rests here. Open up through the center here into a little shell here. We open and close, keeping the inside of your feet attached. Into lift, exhale down. We have one more. Slowly release. Into the other side. Same movements. Okay, back to your side plank. Line your heels up with your bottom. Lift up through your waist. Inhale, sweep your arm up overhead and exhale down. Hold here, come down towards the ground, head rests on your arm. Open up, little shell here, open and close. Inhale, lift, so down. And slowly release, coming back up, back to all fours. All fours, we hold, taking the right leg up just like we did before. 
Engage your bandhas, we hold. Now little, little pulses here, heel up towards the sky and pulse, 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 pulse. And hold, take the knee down towards the ground and lift the leg back up for eight. Down to the ground. And the knee down. Other side, lift the knee off the ground, pull the leg up and pulse for eight. Take the knee down and lift the leg back up. And down. Get your bandhas. Back down to the ground. Let the knee rest back to all fours. Lifting your right knee to the side, we lift our leg up to the side and back down like we did before with the shell. Four more. Back down and now lift your leg back up for eight and down. One more. Now take that leg back up and pulse for eight, seven. Slowly release, other side. Side leg lift, take the knee up to the side, back down. You can come down. Onto your forearms too if you need a break. Or fists. That's always nice to do. You make fists instead of your hands flat. Not gripping too hard, too much. I lost count. <laughs> and we always have to do more. And take the knee back down and then up for eight. Now we lift and pulse. Release into child's pose. Ah. Forehead rest. Release, roll over to your back. To bridge, always looking up towards the sky. Rich, we'll do some pulses here when we do lift our pelvis up towards the sky, palms down. If you need to look to see what I'm doing at first, please uh, don't do the movement, just look and then start. Palms down. We lift our pelvis up to the sky. We hold and pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Hold, squeezing your glutes. Pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and hold. Pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, 
One, hold, squeeze your glutes. Draw your knees so that it's ankles, knees, hips in line with each other. Slowly release, take your pelvis down to the ground. Knees into the chest and hold. Holding, holding. Let your exhale breath help you just to soften and let go into the ground. Let it go. Hope you heard my nice exhale breath. Now you have nice exhale breaths there too. And smile. Opening up your eyes, take your legs up, legs up the wall, open up the legs into the taking the legs back to the center, bend through the knees. Our final pose, Shavasana. Just on your back or on the side of the body, incline or seated. Finding what you would like to do. So you can come into meditation. Closing your eyes. I am definitely nice and warm, but you may need to place a blanket over your body to stay warm. That's the important part. The breath softens. Let your lips part. With mindful meditation, we are present. Noticing our body, noticing our mind. Letting yourself be. Slowly coming back to our lying on the ground, seated. Notice the surface you are lying on. Is it hard? Is it soft? It's a nice, calm feeling around you. 
Keeping this calm feeling. Gentleness with yourself. Starting to wiggle your toes and your fingers. And if you're lying on the ground, you may bend through your knees. Right arm comes overhead and roll over to the right side to the feet off. You may take a moment. Take your way up to a comfortable seated position. Put your hands to your heart center. Thank you everyone for joining me and sharing your practice. Namaste.